We'll proceed on allegation number one tonight. Okay. Now, before you uh, begin any testimony or your portion or your, your side of the complaint, I'd ask that you please raise your right hand. Okay. <coughs> do you swear or affirm the testimony you give before this committee shall be the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? I do. Thank you, you may lower your hand. Thank you. If you would, please state your name for the record. My name is Clay Tillman. I live at 214 East Park Street, Hay Highway, Georgia. Um, one thing I would like to clarify quickly before getting involved in number one is that um, there was a lot of question last week as as to the the question was how long have I lived in Hay Hyra? And um, I, I told someone um, 2009. I closed on my house in 2009. But um, I have been a resident of Hayhara for very many years. I was, and you're smiling. I lived down the street from you. I grew up down the street from Patrick Warren. Sure. Dr. Parrott delivered me. Um, Ms. Adams, I grew down, up down the street from her family for 13 years. I have known a lot of gentlemen in this town. And um, I'm very proud to say that I love Hayhira. I love being able to say I am from Hayhira. Um, not so much lately. Um, I feel that I'm very disappointed in myself as well as many other citizens. We have given up on our little town. We have quit coming to meetings. We have um, not been involved much in the, there are a lot of, a lot of people that have been and I applaud them. But when you ride by on a, th a Thursday night during a city council meeting, there are not very many cars in the parking lot. So basically, um, we had a mayor that had no one to run against him and has decided that it's okay to run the city how he wants because we all have turned a blind eye to what is going on. And it's very unfortunate. I hate that this um, someone mentioned a black cloud. This has brought up a black cloud over here <coughs> last Thursday. And I hate they feel that way, but I feel the same way. I feel like our our mayor has um, caused a lot of embarrassment, undue embarrassment to this little town, and it's very unfortunate. Um, in proceeding with number one... Mr. Tim, before you proceed, I'd just like to ask, do you have any witnesses that you intend to call as it relates to allegation number one in the complaint? I don't feel like I need witnesses, thank you. Is that no? No. Uh, Mr. Bullard, as a respondent, do you have any witnesses that you intend to call as it relates to allegation number one? No. no. Okay, thank you. In regards to allegation number one, in 2010, permission